hey guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Josephine and in today's video I'm gonna be doing a DIY pink lip balm at home before that make sure you subscribe to the channel hit the bell button to be notified every single time I post and don't forget to like comment and share so you are gonna be needing a styrofoam bowl and spoon and petroleum gel I'll be using the Vaseline petroleum jelly today Put my Vaseline into the bowl and went ahead to melt it and it doesn't have to be liquid it can be creamy and soft so I'm going to add Vesagel and this is up to you I just decided to do this and this is basically gonna make your lips moisturized with the Vaseline it's completely optional and not very necessary after that I'm just gonna go ahead to mix the Vaseline and the Vesagel to get it very soft so that is basically the two ingredients you are gonna be needing then i'm going to go ahead and put this cool pink mica pigment into my lip balm and this pigment is cosmetic gray so you don't have to worry about putting it on your lips then i'm going to go ahead to mix these products i want it to be very mixed mixed very well yeah that and i'm going to put a little bit of the mica pigment into my lip balm because i wasn't really liking how light it was so i'm going ahead to put a little bit of the pigment in it then i'm going to mix it and i really love the cool pink color and how it has this shimmery effect to the lip balm so i'm then going to scrape the sides of the bowl and bring so that i can mix everything together completely So I'm going to be needing my syringe for now and this is the 60 ml syringe. I'm just going to suck it in and then whilst I was doing this, it was taking forever to get the lip balm into the syringe. So I just decided to scoop it into the syringe with my spoon. Yeah, that way I thought it was going to be faster. So these are the mini containers I'm going to be using. Yeah, so when I started filling the containers, I was doing it wrongly. So later on in the video, you are going to see how to do it properly. Yeah, so I'm just going to take my containers, fill it to the top, and I'm going to flatten it with my spoon, making sure that everything is smooth and straight. Then afterwards, I'm going to clean the sides of the jar with my fingers, making sure there is no residue of the product. And you want to close it and put it in the fridge or freezer once you are done. And I'm going to repeat it for all the containers. This is what I was talking about. So you want to go in a circular motion whilst putting your lip balm inside the jar and this is the proper way to do it to avoid air bubbles and to make everything nice and smooth
So this is how our lip balms ended up looking after taking them out of the fridge and I really like the cool pink color. So that's the end of today's video. Thank you guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Like, comment and share and let's see what I've got for you in my next video. Bye.